Increasing agricultural productivity is absolutely essential for the global population. You may think, ah, oh, biology, and you'd be right to an extent, but the chemical sciences will have a really crucial role in areas such as improving nutrient use efficiency. Plants need external nutrients, but we need to formulate them in such a way that we minimise any negative environmental impacts. And then of course there's soil, which is absolutely fundamental to helping us increase crop yields. A whole range of chemical reactions and processes take place in soil and between roots of plants and the soil. Understanding these is absolutely critical. And finally, there's crop protection chemicals. Chemistry has always had a role in this area. It was actually natural product synthesis research that took place in the UK that led to the discovery of azoxystrobium, which is the world's best-selling agricultural fungicide. Now, if I still haven't convinced you, let me leave you with this. In 1960, a single hectare was needed to feed two people. By 2050, that same hectare will need to feed more than six people with fewer resources and with greater consideration for the environment. We won't be able to do that without chemistry.